Legend of Total War here with part 65 of my Empire Total War Let's Play campaign as the Ottoman Empire. Uh, last time we got uh, we got peace with the Marathon Confederacy, and these uh, and Savoy declared war on us. So what they're doing at the moment is sending basically their entire navy against my guys. I had four four fifth rate ships last battle where they sent 20 ships against me, and we won, but we lost one ship. I stole. They're three Dales. I feel like they might have stolen these off me at some point and just got them back. I don't know. Well, they got them from somewhere. And now we have these three ships. Okay. Now let's use this this one first. Let's see where they're going to come from. Probably down here. Let's try and do the same thing as I did last time. Except better because last time didn't particularly go very well. There's less ships this time, so one fifth-rate ship should be enough to handle them. We had just got completely overwhelmed by their numbers, and they squashed us right near the red line. But overall, we did win. Now, the odds are against us, but we know that if we shred their sails, which is the most effective way to win on very high difficulty, in my opinion, then we should be okay. Okay, they're... They're being bitches about this. Alright, get into their range. Taking some damage. Can't be shooting them from the front on. I mean from the side. It needs to be front on. Where the hell are they going? These units here are going to be of no value to me, so get them to retreat. I think they're aiming for these guys. Well, I've slowed it down a little bit, just not by that much. God damn it. Didn't really work according to plan, and they've pushed us right near the red line. Hey, well, no, no, no. You, you just come over here. Come on, get out of there. So already, this hasn't gone very well. I need you to get out of there. I need you to come over here. Because now they're not even facing the wind. Try and go around. God damn it. This isn't working at all. Good thing our ships can take a bit of a punch. Alright, come around the rear of them. You guys just wait there. It's this silly formation that they use here. It's kind of annoying. It's actually a pretty good formation, but... Um, my technique doesn't really work on it. But they will break out of it eventually. <laughs> Shit in the rear of them. It's alright, come on, speed up. Good. I think after all that we lost maybe one or two cannons, so it's not too severe. Let's pick on the guys coming last. Oh, he's got his shit down. Alright, um. See if we can hit this motherfucker. I think they just broke rank. Good. And now they're all coming for me directly. You guys get moving as well. Actually, try and stick together. We might need it. If they're all coming all at once... Okay, let's slow this down. We're going to need a lot of cannonballs.
probably was a low priority to shoot at that. There's all these guys here that have full sails. Okay, significantly slowed. That's good. Can you guys get ready to turn around? I want your cannon fire on them straight away. You need to move it. Let's keep going. These guys are going to provide support. Help slow these guys down a bit. Just keep moving. Oh crap, it's right near the red line. Good thing it's not that many of them. I think we can get them slowed down in time. Someone's been slowed down a little bit. Yeah, you need to use your cannons. Got to slow this guy down right away. He's catching up. Okay, good. He's slowed down. guy needs to get out of the way. I suppose if we go down this way, we should get still plenty of wind and have just more space to move. So we need to shoot this one. Slow it right down. Okay, good. Okay, what do we got left? Okay, that's the only ship now that's got... Uh, Sales. Except for these two, they're hanging back. A bunch of idiots. Okay, that one's routing, which is fine, but I want to surrender, of course. Still gotta get away from this guy. Luckily their cannons are really weak. And our hull is very strong. There's not as strong as say a second rate ship, but, or a fourth rate ship for that matter, but still, it's pretty good. Gotta get out of their line of sight. This is why I like to use just one ship, but there's just too many of them. What are you doing? Slowing down like this. Okay, we got others coming in. Okay, this one's been slowed down considerably. Surrendered. Very good. So that's the first ship to give up. Good. We've got a nice big advantage now. They're still trying to aim for our sails. What are you doing? Turn around. Got to be aiming for this guy now. Good, slow it down a little bit. Yeah, they're definitely aiming for the sails, but that's that's fine. I mean, as long as we've still got one ship still able to function, then that's good enough. So we need to get away from this guy. Good, slow it down a bit more. Oh, 
Oh crap, they got rid of the main sail. This battle did not go down very well. Still confident that we'll win, but uh, yeah, it didn't go very well. This motherfucker keeps turning around. Son of a bitch. Come out this way. At least this is where the wind's going. We should be hanging out here. This guy's still got full sail, but one of his broadsides is uh, smashed up. Okay, try and get away from these guys. slowing down, that's good. You need to get out of there, you keep getting shot. Well, if they're only hitting us with chain shot, you're actually fine. This one's routing, that's good. Make it surrender. Okay, we've still got this guy to deal with. Thing sails repair automatically after battle. But still, we need to get these guys repaired. And they need another one to replace the one that was lost last battle. Shred those sails. Okay, routing but hasn't surrendered. Should be out of range of this guy. Okay, gotta get rid of that sail. Good. And that one surrendered as well. Good job. Okay, it's not much left to deal with. Guys have all slowed down, so there should be easy pickings. Yeah, you're not going to you're not going to damage that one. It's got no sails left. Go around. Part of me thinks we're going to have to start using cannonballs. Round shot. Because they've got no sails left, but they're not uh, surrendering. I mean, these shots are still making... Ugh. God, these guys managed to turn around. Alright. Bomb them. They don't want to bloody surrender. Then kill them. Okay, surrendered. Okay, go back to using chain shot. This guy shouldn't be a big threat. Alright, back to regular shot. I don't give a shit. Doesn't matter if it reduces the price of the the earnings. I just want this over with.
So it's routing, but not surrendered. Here, get rid of it with the... Uh, what's it called? Chain shot. I'm sure it'll surrender. There we go. One more. This one, I think, deserves round shot. Right in its ass. I think we're done here. Very good. So you get to steal them all. And sell them. Probably looking at maybe six grand. Maybe five. Which is better than nothing. Yeah, five and a half. Okay, so what we'll do here, just grab that real quick. Scupper. Unscupper. When I want the cannons. Good, that fixed it right up. Let's see if we can do one more like that. No, that's fine. Uh, so this is another fifth rate of mine versus uh, bomb catch. Yeah, we do not want to be fighting a bomb catch. Withdraw. We need to get rid of Savoy. Are they actually attacking? Look, we're in a state where we can just auto-resolve this. Lost a few guys, but we're in pretty good shape. Good, keeps the rebellion going. I didn't want to finish them off. Of course, I could have fought that manually and done a lot better job, but it wasn't worth a half-hour battle for it. Okay, letters of demand in Malta. It's fixed up. Okay. Got letters of demand for Estonia and Livonia up here. They're okay now. How are we going here for Islam? It's improving, slowly. Might help if we improve the industrialization situation. Holy crap. Alright, I got all that money from from taking their ships. Right. Fleet arrives. Over here, more trade. Uh, we don't really have any spots to put these guys, do we? We're going to go to war with Denmark. Which is... Hang on. That's Marathon Confederacy. Don't mess with them just yet. Denmark's over here. What have they got? Indiamen. Yeah, just bring one of these ships over here. Oh, hang on. I've screwed that. Yep, none of that's important. Okay, we'll, we'll come back to that situation there. Gotta be careful of that Savoy fleet. Bomb catches are a pain in the ass. Genoa's not looking at its best right now. Got our guys over here. Oh, right, I was thinking, what the hell happened to the army? But they're hanging out over here. We've got our guys here. Hopefully ready to take out Savoy at their capital. How rich is this settlement? It's not very, so they're a bit war weary. Which army of this is of mine, is it? Ah, oh, it's crap army. Whatever. Get him over there, let's let's have a fight. I doubt we'll be able to auto resolve this. Oh, God damn it! Tell me you could fucking make it, and then it doesn't. And then, of course, there's tons of armies out this way. So that's great. Oh, well, we're just gonna have to put up with it. Okay, I've got this ship over here. Who's Sweden at war with? Let's have a look. At war with Denmark. Okay, we can't offer to join war. Let's have a look here. Denmark. They are rated weak and destitute. If they don't accept this, then we declare war. 
Okay, war it is then. And this will give us dominance over... Oh, hang on, what's their other allies? They have no allies, but they're at war with Great Britain as well. Uh, nope. Over here, coast of Brazil. So this is owned by Denmark. What have they got? A big fleet full of crap. Two of my ships should easily be able to take take that on. All right, so let's do it. Don't call in my allies. We don't need their help. That way they're attacking us. Got reinforcements coming in. Okay, all good. This should be fine. So obviously the plan here is to, just like all other battles, make all their ships surrender. We'll take what we want, the three Indiamen, and uh, sell the rest for spare parts. Now our ship over here, how's it holding up? That's alright, it'll be fine. Okay, it's a bit of a foggy day. Which would not have made a difference even if I had initiated the attack. So where are they? They're over here, just looking at the map. Can't even see them, it's so foggy. There they are. Ah, oh, great. Like so going against the wind here. Well, they're going against the wind. Okay, where's this guy? Try and keep him out of it for now. To stay put. I'd rather just use one. Balance of power is not looking too good, but that doesn't really matter. Well, hopefully we've got enough space with which to do a run. If we go in that direction, we'll eventually come in contact with my other ships. Hang on, hang on, careful. Okay, looks like they might have broken rank out of their silly line. No, not quite. Oh, that's pretty good range. All of those shots look like it hit. But it didn't do very much damage. If we can get around the rear of them, that might be okay. They'll do, a, they'll do a spin around us a little bit, and then they'll break rank. really do not like fighting in fog. I like dry conditions because I need to be able to see what's going on. Okay, these guys... Are... I don't know. Good, that slowed it down significantly. Whoa, this guy's back here. Indiaman, right. And that one's out of the battle pretty much. Ah, these fuckers are coming in now. More concerned about these other ships than the Indiamen, but they're all coming at the same time. Okay, as long as we shred their sails, they're no threat to us. Good, I think we're faster than that one now. These Indiamen are not really much of a threat in the first place. Okay, that's the next ship we need to be destroying. Not this one. Oh, well, whichever, just, just aim for something. I'm sure the cannons are reloaded. If we pick the right one. Oh, they're not reloaded. Come on, hurry up. This one here, go for it. Good. That'll slow it down significantly. But 
probably oh shit they've got cannons on the front or something. No, they're just that's just gunmen. Okay, we've got another ship coming in here. We've got a few guns reloaded, but it's not all of them. Okay, now they're all reloaded. Hit this motherfucker up. It slowed down, but probably not enough. Probably about the same speed as us now. Still plenty more coming. It's getting a little bit overwhelming, but as long as we keep slowing them down, keep getting shots in, we'll eventually get there. Doesn't matter if we lose one ship. After all, we've got a backup one as well. They keep shooting at the crew. It's not going to do anything. We've got heaps. Get this motherfucker. Now it's slowed down. Enough that we don't have to worry about it. These things here, they've got such weak shot that we don't have anything to worry about with them either. Okay, just get some distance from them. We've still got plenty of room to move before we hit the red line as well. Okay, that's reloading. Okay, we want to slow this one down. Yeah, it's good. Getting there. Still lots of ships here with full sails. That being said, we're in good shape. Okay, that's no longer a threat. Speed things up a bit. They've killed one crew member since last I checked. It's hardly anything. There's more than a hundred left. I'm gonna try and shoot this motherfucker here. Good, he's not doing anything to us now. Okay, we've got another fast guy coming in. Good. Getting fairly close to the red line now. I feel like we need to be really targeting fast guys. Okay, here he comes. Two of them. They're not so fast now. Oh shit, we got more incoming. Alright, time to slow down. two at once. That could be a problem. Crap. Dodged us. Just lost a few cannons. Now that's a problem when that happens. But that being said, they just they lost all their goddamn sails. Come on, shoot the bastard. Alright, good. He's, he's out of the picture now. I think his friend fucking did that to him. They got too close to each other. Just need to get around its front, get rid of that last little mainsail. Ah, oh, whatever, it's not important. Slow this guy down. Who's still got sails left? Now we're we're all good here. 
Alright, what I'll do is I'll pause the recording whilst I deal with the rest of this, because basically the battle's won. There's nothing much to be concerned about. Okay, so I'm pretty sure there's just one more ship left to worry about. The others are all surrendered. I brought the other ship in as well. This one's taken a bit of damage, but we should be able to repair its cannons after the battle. Hey, killed the Admiral after the fucking fight's over, but whatever. That was a pretty easy one. Didn't need to bring in the second ship, but it helped speed things up. Alright. Well, it's a good thing this one is the one that took the damage, because that's the only one we can repair, I think. Actually, I don't think that's true. Okay, that'll do. Yep, that one's at good strength. So I get seven grand. Oh, fuck, I forgot to take the um, Indiaman. Oh, well, it's not the end of the world. What we've just done there, though, is increase the price of sugar, I'm sure, because they're not trading on it. And now I'll just send, what's this, Indiaman. Here, because the first ship that you put on there always gains the most. It hasn't really increased my income, but at least we've uh, increased our market share of the uh, sugar. Now we have complete dominance here, so that's good. These ships aren't in the best shape, but uh, they'll they'll handle the situation for now. Right, and over here, this is a very small operation here. This fifth rate will be able to handle it by itself. I don't see any need to record this battle, it's just going to be very quick and easy. Alright, so I captured both ships. This time I actually take them, thank you. Didn't take any damage on it. And I'll be taking this resource, thank you very much. Increasing my market share and eliminating theirs. That has not increased my income very much at all, and I'd say, yeah, either is not worth much at all now. But, it's not going to be worth much for them either. So but then again, it's the AI. What do they care about money? They probably get heaps of bonuses and shit. Yeah, we've got to watch out for the Dutch. Bomb catchers. So how many ships do we have here? We've only got the two. I, think it's, yeah, I don't know. And the Marathon Confederacy is not really much to worry about. We'll probably have to go to war with them again soon, but let's not worry about that right now. Okay, that's good. So then, uh, Savoy, what are we going to do about, that, about them? So Islam's increasing at a slow rate. These guys are providing five garrison repression. If we were to leave and not tax it. We could do so. I mean, it reduces our income, but uh, I kind of feel like we need to get him... Hang on. Where are we going to go pick up some troops out there? Uh, hang on, these guys are out here as well. I really want to avoid that bomb catch, so we'll have to move from port to port. Just take one. A lot of effort just for one guy. It's because I fucked up over there. Doesn't matter. Okay, so we've got five here. We need more. Maybe we should be training the cheaper units. The, I mean, two of those and one of those. Okay, let that keep going. Because that, that'll take three turns to build as it is. Right, and what are we going to do with these armies out here? I suppose they're, they're holding down the garrison for now. So, Prague. It's not too bad, but the, uh, the nobles don't particularly like us. But that'll get fixed up in time. This one here. Yeah, it'll be fixed up in time. Especially when Islam takes further, further hold over the territory. Just because there's so much religious unrest at the moment. 
Saxony should be all good. Because we've got this. Need to recruit another. Oh, what's it called? 18 pounder. Okay, these guys here took a little bit of damage. They can be put to replenish. I can't believe that cost me over a thousand. Just for that small victory. Whatever, assholes. No point fixing anything up, they're just going to keep on wrecking it. I wonder if we should even destroy that. No, just leave it. And how are we going over here? Because I'd like to finish off this rebellion. It doesn't seem to be growing at all. I think it's the public order here is still... still shite. Heck, what can we do to fix this up? I mean, Islam's growing. I suppose we just need to wait. We could exempt it from taxation, but even that won't fix it. Small amount of oppression gained from that. Alright, well we got 40,000 here to spend, so let's... Let's spend that on... Hang on, what's Denmark up to? Yeah, whatever. Um, let's just see. Okay, so we've got 40,000. Let's... Spe oh, hang on. I've got to build another... I think I'll build another couple of fifth rates. Make it three. I mean, they don't cost that much in upkeep, and they've been fantastic in, in giving me uh, naval dominance. I undoubtedly have control over the sea at the moment. Okay, more bales of cotton. That's pretty good, because cotton is actually worth quite a bit. Plus, it'll also increase tradable goods here that... You can actually tax that as well, so you get a double base of income. That'll help make this region wealthy again. Of course, you never know. Some navy might come down here at some point and attack Egypt. It's undefended. And then just completely screw us up. What's this? Okay, we need a money maker here. So, go for the craft workshop. Public order is not the best. What can I do to fix that up? Oh, there's another one here. Need a money maker. Could destroy Tehran Traditional University. No, I'm not going to bother fixing that. This place is happy. Build that. Needed to continue growing. It's very happy. And then, of course, once it's finished, just build the next thing. Okay, that needs to be repaired. We improve the wealth of the world. Good, improve that. None of that's going to help that situation there. Let's see. Still got a few things we need to research. Uh, okay, over here. Yep, fix that up. Still got heaps of money to spend. Fix it up. Grab that. Next one was asking me about prestige. Where am I? I'm a little bit behind the Marathon Confederacy. So I'm ranked at number two. Militarily, I'm the best. Let's see, naval. I'm the best, but they're far more enlightened than I am. In fact, as far as enlightenment's concerned, I'm not that high. Okay, Russia's a good place to invest into because... Well, it's safe. Even if it is poor, it's very safe. Islam's dominant here. It's growing quite quickly, that's good. Yep, just have it keep going with that. What's this? Yep, grab that. Now don't invest into this territory, it's shite. Just leave it be. After a 
fucking 50 more turns, we'll convert that other building to money maker. Is this region making any cash? Yeah, it's making a fair bit, so it wouldn't hurt to reduce that town watch cost. How much are we paying in town watch at the moment? Two and a half grand. So yeah, anything we can do to reduce it, certainly good. Yeah, we've got this under control here. How much is that? That's so we've held um, Russia for a long time. So it basically means 30 turns ago we were at war with these guys. Well, the war ended less than 30 turns ago. Because Russia's been defeated. So, but there's not a heap load of religious unrest here, so that's good. Everything seems okay here. Hang right, on, look at this. We've got a building here to work with. It's quite wealthy. So, let's... Islam's increasing, so let's just go... Go money. Keep the wealth coming in. Can this region grow any further? Yep, corner. So, I mean, this isn't really going to make a difference, but uh, feel free to invest further into the territory. Okay, still got 10 grand. We can't invest into Warsaw. It's fucked. Over here. Invest into that. This region's. Oh, okay, it's not being taxed, that's why. Well, we can tax it now, so do that. How are we going here for Islam? Yeah, it's growing. How, though? Wait, what's this? I'll oh, write it, that's the madrasa or whatever. I'd rather not. Getting close to the frontier here. Alright, so this territory here, yep, can invest in that. Slo Islam's slowly taking hold there. There's a lot of region wealth from this, so yes, grab that. Then again, they are quite happy. People in government are making them happy. And over here. Sure. Don't invest too close here because it's going to be a pretty nasty war, I think. I feel like I should actually be bringing more troops over here to deal with them. Let's have a look. So these guys here, no, they're, they're going to need to stay there. What about these guys? Maybe. No, we'll see. This can be fixed up. Let's go with let's go with the madrasa. Is I'm spreading there very quickly. Okay, there we go. I think that's all we need to do this turn. Yeah. Still need to plan out some sort of revenge against the Maratha Confederacy. Okay, these guys need to move. Be cool if we could just hit them and then ask for a peace treaty again before they strike back. Slowly grind them down into nothing. Just by being mean. Then again, we're making quite a bit of money off them, so maybe not worry about that too much. Okay, I'll sell you over here. Have you got the guys or not? Yeah, you've got them. Good. Actually, sail to uh, Heraklion. Okay, you... Uh, no, we need these guys, even if we're not full strength. We need them to go up north to help out against Savoy. You know they've got basically no navy there now. Okay, hopefully we can leave here. If not, we just won't tax it. No, it's under control. Very good. I'll 
Oh, look at this. We can actually land here. Here we go, and we'll take Savoy from here. Or we can go into France. But to be honest, I'm a little bit concerned about these guys here. Well, it's very much in our favour. Let's demand a surrender. Nope. We could auto-resolve this. We wouldn't take that much damage. I don't think these guys would have the balls to fight us afterwards. So that's what I'm going to do. Ooh, lost a lot more men. I think we lost a lot of men in the other army. Yeah, it seems fairly evenly distributed, but uh, whatever the case is, they took more damage. Okay, well, we can't repair that this turn. Unless we go... I don't know. We'll need to go cancel a few buildings. Let's see here. That's likely going to cost me a bit of a small fortune to fix up. Could rather not have fought that. It would have taken a long time. And really just not been that enjoyable at all. I feel like those are needed. Did we try and create a palatial estate down here or something? No, I need that. Well, it's getting us two and a half grand. Let's see, how much is this bill going to cost us here? That's one grand, so that's doable. And this one here is probably where the majority of it is. Oh, didn't cost us very much at all. Hardly anything. Oh no, I think it can wait. Just purchase that. Oh, no, I, I need to order those, uh, those units. Because I want to send them over to, to deal with, uh, what's it called? To deal with uh, Paris. If we get to Paris before they can get back there, we could probably take that without much of a fight. And then that'll just be the end of them. I'm pretty sure they've got no more territories. Uh, don't we building something down here? Yeah, cancel that. Yeah, whatever. And we've got to fix this up so that if we are going to be retraining, it's not going to be... Oh, screw it. Just leave it as it is. That's how we got into trouble last time, anyway. With it. Okay, and grab that. Okay, uh, we've still got a bit of cash. Just, what's this? Yep, invest into that. Okay. And Tunis is okay. So how much money are we going to be making at the end turn? That's, that's alright. I don't think Savoy have got any more. Oh, hang on. We've got to send these guys on their way. With them. Off to a trade resource for you. You just get off there for a second. Let me just see how much money are we making from raiding. So three thousand to. It's not much, but it's something. Better than nothing, I guess. And you guys, I've got to send you back somewhere around here for retraining. Yeah, come up here. This can be repaired. I can't afford it. It's okay, we'll do it next turn. There's no there's no need to have uh, dominance here. What the hell? A Savoy. What the hell are these guys doing here? Kuland. Blockading the Spanish port here. I don't really care about Spain. We don't trade with them. That's fine. Okay, let's move on to the next turn. Having Savoy back off from there. 
Okay, so I'm going to go block out a few ports, are they? Hopefully that wasn't worth much. Well, if that's all they've got, that's not much at all. Fuck off. We lost 88 men, no big deal. Okay, who died? Hashashin. I don't care about him anyway. So you gained one happiness to the nobility. Who, who are you? Well, let me just see, who was that? Was it you? Was it you? Oh, it could have been anyone. But if that's the case and he did gain... Well, that seemed to help. Well, good. Let's have a look here. Making some cash, that's good. Okay, now we've got two options here. We can either send these guys down here to go up there. Or we can send this one. Now if we send this one up there, this here is going to have to be protected by him. And th these guys are weak. But they're strong. But then again, this has got a fort. So they should be able to handle it. But wait, they're not melee troops. But they should still be able to handle it. So yeah, send these guys, because what well, if there's a full stack waiting for us there? Why can't they move? Because this guy's going to intercept us. Okay, so what we want to do, just a little bit of sort of daisy chaining. It's not really daisy chaining, but just get him on the ship. Get him over there. Because that's the fastest way. So we just want to bypass the Alps. Go wreck the seminary. What's the fastest way to France? Still a couple of turns to get there, but that's okay. I want to go out this way so we can. Nope, but they're just stuck there for the turn. That's fine. You guys can come back here. Get your repairs on. Ah, uh, the port needs to be fixed first. It's okay. And you have got free reign to get over here now. There were no letters of demand this turn, were there? So look at the policies and... Well, I've already been taxing everything. I mean, this one here is not... Okay, just all I can do is sit you there. And hopefully nothing happens. If you just want to sit there and wait, then that's great. Because if we could defeat these guys without having to fight all these armies, then that's the ideal situation. Okay, I don't know what Denmark's going to be up to, but I, I doubt that they'll be able to form a counter-attack of any sufficient force. Uh, this guy here, this Dow, should probably be sent off to go trade. Come back down here. Okay, this army here... Uh, didn't I train cannons? What happened to the fucking cannons that I had ordered? This game's glitched. Did it train it here as well? Yes. So what the fuck happened to the ones that I put in the queue here? Do I have to train something twice these days? It's a 24, 24 pound foot artillery. Are these mobile or, or what? So they'd have better range, wouldn't they? Right, they became outdated because this was finished, the gunnery school. So, if we look previously... Ah, oh God. I have to look in the building browser. So if we were to upgrade this again... Bombardment mortars. Okay, well, yes, that sounds great. I think with that we'll end the video there. So the situation's looking very nice. Ever since we defeated Prussia, we've 
and uh, got peace with the Maratha Confederacy, no one's really able to stand up to us, and we're just sort of slowly gaining more money. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe. Part 66 is next, and don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.